Hi, it's me again with Corel Roll Tips and Tricks, and I just did a video last night, and I mentioned that video I used at rounded corners when I was contouring, so we open up effects and contour, but there's some parts that are uh, more pointed, so we have rounded corners like on his ear. This is the way you'd probably want to do it, even if you're cutting out a sticker, but I thought I'd show you how you could do some of the contour in rounded corners and some of them in in uh, square corners. So we've got our object here. We're gonna grab it, we're gonna go to object. Well, a lot of times you have to grab the whole thing, go to object, break the contour part. We're actually gonna take the contour and nudge it over four inches. Now what we can do is take the a two point line and we'll just go from there to there, there to there and probably there to there, so six little lines. I don't think I got that one on. So just take your shape tool and, so now we're gonna delete every rounded corner that we actually want square. And we've got that, so now we're gonna take this cat and nudge it down, but I still have these lines. Now I'm gonna take it and round and do it with mitered corners or square corners, hit apply, go up to object, break contour apart, move the con, well, gotta just grab the contour. And you can see down there it's black, so I didn't get the contour, I got the, the cat itself. Zoom in and get the, now we can see it's red. Nudge it over. Now we're gonna delete the opposite of what we deleted before. And like I said, this is, this is kind of off the chart. Uh, probably would never want to do this, but it is pretty cool. So now we have the four points. And what you can do, because those are still a group, instead of deleting those six lines, you could nudge that over. Then you could delete your six lines, take that and nudge it back. And then, well, let's go actually over and down. Now the, the other cat still, so now we have a sharp ear and sharp, it's a little bit much. We can take our virtual segment delete key and delete this because now we're gonna use the smart fill tool to fill this in. Grab the smart fill tool, fill that in, nudge it up, left click, right click, make sure it's a hairline if you're gonna cut it and then nudge it over to the cat and now you have rounded corners and square corners. Now this is this is a little bit over, you know, it's a little bit much, but it's just give you an idea if you ever had to do that. And then to make the cat black, we could just fill the cat in to get it back to its original. So now you have a cut line with two different contours. I hope that helped a little bit. Thank you for watching.